physics. It's the study of the forces that make matter move. Everything moves, except for dead people and stones. <laughs> and who wants to study them? Geologists. Who? Geologists. What are they? Stone studiers. Fair play to them. We're here with Dr. Kieran Moran, who is the head of the School of Health and Human Performance at DCU. How are you getting on, Kieran? Very well, thank you. Now, Kieran, can you tell us a bit about what you do as a scientist? Uh, I'm a biomechanist, so I study human movement with the whole idea of increasing people's sports performance and reducing the likelihood of injury or increasing the functional capacity of people to move. Can you make a man jump over a fence? Yep. <laughs> cool. We're here to learn about physics. Physics is the science of the forces that move matter. So we came here to a car park to listen to some dubstep. Why? Because dubstep music has a lot of bass, and bass frequencies are a force that move matter. So we're going to use dubstep bass to move what's known as a non-Newtonian liquid. So Mr. Chrome here is going to put in some corn flour and a bit of water. Put in a bit of red food colouring as well, just for fun. Oh yeah. Like Dracula's lunch. In my hand it looks like I've got a, like a ball, right? Because it's a solid. When it's moving, it's a solid. But as soon as I let it go still, oh my god, it turns into a liquid. Isn't that unbelievable? Turn it up there, Coco. Holy moly, it looks so cool. It looks like computer graphics, doesn't it? Now, this might just look like a man in his jocks hitting the golf ball up against a curtain, but it's actually cutting edge science. What's all this? Okay, uh, we use technology a lot to analyse movement and sport. So here we have thousands of sensors built into an insole that you can put into your shoe. So we can measure the amount of force being applied to the foot, and if those forces are too large, we try and change the way in which they run to reduce those amounts of forces. And if he was to dance either the Macarena, the Cha Cha or the Tango, would you be able to tell which one it is by watching the footage? I think the three of us together could. And we could figure it out, we yeah. Could. Do one of the above and, and we'll try and tell you which one it is. Behind our backs. That's a merengue. That's a merengue. I thought that was a macarena now. No, that's a merengue. I know it. I know my dancing. Challenge. Physics. Chemistry. Einstein. Feelings. Snorkel balls. Running around. 